Rapid decarbonization of industries in general is placing a lot of challenges and impacts to the electric grid. The electric grid must adapt and evolve to new and innovative forms of generation, new and innovative forms of loads, and only through a new type of research can these challenges be met. There is almost no more exciting engineering problem globally right now than the challenge of converting our currently reliable and affordable electrical energy supply system to one that is now to be constrained to be carbon neutral. We do need to collaborate both with universities, with our industry partners, as well as with our key re researchers to really address this future path. We're also doing that in a way that really educates students and provides them with the background that they need to be able to, to address this major societal shift. It requires a research that is highly collaborative. It requires a research that is highly engaged with the industry. It requires a research that engages young minds with new thinking, new ideas. Cooper stands for Center for Advanced Power Engineering Research. This is an industry university consortium. To resolve these new challenges we're facing today. CAPER is a university and industry collaborative that allows challenges and R&D opportunities from industry to be brought directly to the universities. Funded by industry where our students, our faculty, our staff and our facilities are integrated to give a great experience to our students and um, research opportunity for our faculty. Each faculty member brings a different point of view and brings um, a different interest and different skill sets. Really good things come up when the people of, of diverse expertise come together, talk and work towards solving a problem. As we look at the grid of the future, it's not just engineering or environmental or civil challenges that we'll see. While there are key topics in these areas, most of the challenges that the industry face are multidisciplinary. We can work with the industry leaders, including people from Duke Energy, Siemens, and Savannah River National Lab. We have a truly interdisciplinary team that have expertise from power system, power electronics, artificial intelligence, and renewable energies. These problems we're facing today are so complex and challenging, the engagement of young minds is, is necessary to come up with new and innovative solutions. So one of the unique aspects of CAPER is that it allows us to bring together teams and multidisciplinary teams from multiple universities to look at the real world challenges that the industry is facing and provide these innovative solutions. I think the biggest uh, impact of a lot of the research projects is a lot of that communication from some of the more state-of-the-art ideas that are going on in, in, the more re, in the more research space, in the academic space, with the, the current issues or issues that are coming down the pipeline. With the CAPER projects, it's sort of like a symbiotic relationship. The thing that most excites me is that we get to work with real tools that are used in industry as well as real data. So we're not looking at something theoretical in a lab that will never even be built. We're looking at things that are actually in existence and actually will happen. Getting involved with this project kind of gave me a feel that I'm actually contributing to research, contrib contributing to progress in the field. Being involved with CAPER and being involved with the other institutions really give you a huge advantage into your studies, your project development, but also a glimpse into what the real world is like after you graduate. I guess it was a positive feedback loop in the sense that the more I did, the more I wanted to contribute, and the more I wanted to get involved. I think uh, the biggest advantage that I saw from being involved with CAPER was its industry involvement and the relationships that I made with people in industry, and they're, they're people that even today, I can still call up and ask questions. CAPER has a vast resource of skill set, expertise, and uh, tremendous technologies that are available at their disposal that we can leverage to solve complex, complex problems uh, that we are facing at the industry right now. I think the most uh, meaningful and valuable piece of CAPER is this relationship with industry. 
and they are willing, they are openly share their first-hand data that I don't see there's any other places could make this happen. Our students will be able to work with the utility engineers and then they will have access to actual data and uh, network models and then uh, they have this opportunity to uh, talk with the utility engineers about what's the most uh, urgent problem they need us to resolve and then once they have uh, a result uh, the utility uh, engineers can help us uh, review that. With that industry we don't have the problems, we don't have the applications, we don't have the, the real system data to work with. And that feedback back and forth I think really iterates towards projects that, that are both practical but also uh, give industry a better understanding of some of the, the possibilities that new research and new ideas can bring. So you are going from a problem to a solution and and that requires you to perform lots of activity in between and have some deliverables. Clearly show that our talents, our uh, skills, our uh, solutions being used to solve the real world uh, problem in a very timely manner. I would say a lot of these problems that Cable has uh, sort of uh, given us to solve are something that industries actually need to be solved. It's not something that's uh, like uh, theoretical research. To me, our future is the student. And we need to bring together the collective knowledge that sits resident in all of these different universities. Because that's really bring the research to its, to its goal which is coming to a product or a service. We work with these industry experts. We're working on projects that have tremendous industry relevance. There's an ability to accomplish things if you put your mind to it. And for me, it's accomplishing those things, uh, bringing more folks working on, on this, this energy transformation problem. So being involved with CAPER is one of the, the best opportunities to bring the academic space into the industrial landscape. So looking at the opportunities that are uh, available in industry allows students to uh, directly relate the work that they'll do in their degree path to realistic outcomes that are required for essentially a more sustainable future. CAPER provides the capability to provide the type of research that is needed to solve these new and challenging issues of today. The